Um, you have, I feel you can rush him down, yes, but I lean towards a more defensive style of play, which is taking your time, finding the spots, and capitalizing hard when opportunities present themselves. The thing is, Siegfried just generally hits harder than Wrath on general hits. So you have to be very keen on your reads and, <laughs> and not get counter hit by a uh, 6B hold. Yes. And, uh,. Yeah, it's just like, so say you're fishing for AGA whips with Force 6A, which is a great way to get damage. The thing is, if you if you just hit with Force 6A on its own, you get like 20 damage. But if he hits you with AGA, he gets like 30-something damage and a knockdown. So like, it, the, you have to really be aware of what's going to happen. You got to be really aware of what's going to happen and get your max dividends or else you're going to constantly be out of damage disparity. Yeah, exactly. And also, Sigfreak has the ability to mix it in with those A slide Bs that we were just seeing right there. So if he sees you trying to go for those like four six A's, he can A slide B that, and that's not going to be able to duck under it because that's a mid. Yeah. Oh dear. Okay. That was an uh, interesting interaction. But great sidestep there from Duke. The acknowledgement of the string. With the not caring. Down. See, this is what you do against uh, Shadow Evade. You just say, screw it, you're not going to force your frames. I'm going to do the like, thickest attack I can think of. That gives me the most reward on a successful counter hit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the non just frame version of Ace Live B going to be knocking him out of the ring there. I think the just frame would have slammed him down to the ground in that situation. He wouldn't have actually got the ring out. Oh. So that was a tactical no just frame. Like that match lasted like a minute and a half. That was it very was quick. Very, very quick. And that's when, when, when a Siegfried player is guessing correctly and frequently, here. they are just able to close rounds super, super fast. It's just the, the problem is, at least the player is able to do it. And fortunately for Duke, he is getting these reads. He's hitting like almost every single uh, six B on counter hit. And that's leading to a big damage combo. All right, these characters have comparable wall game. I, I will argue Siegfried is easier to set up. I, I agree, definitely. Uh, Siegfried does a little bit less damage, but it, he gets more conversion off of it. Okay, nice. I like the 2A challenge there from... Oh. But he drops the combo! You gotta delay that AGA just a little bit more, dude! This could play a big factor. Raphael is pressuring him like crazy, but it's nice not bed. going to matter. Okay. That full crouch 3k hold. Yo, the callback to when he was Nightmare. He even stole the move from him. Nightmare player is still angry about it. Ah, I dropped the combo. Not good. Gotta hit those just frames. Keep his turn back. I like the patience there. That's more of the, that defense that you were mentioning earlier, Jimbo, and how to approach the matchup. And this is, uh, dead. He made it a necessary adjustment because, like, pretty much every time he did Soul Charge 8 AB, he would always step the vertical. So this time he just cut it short and then hit him with a different attack. So yeah, showing yeah, ability to adapt. Mm -hmm. All right. These adaptations are incredibly key, especially this level of the tournament. You're trying to give his money, you're trying to go and fight for the grand finals. Oh, God. Here we go. Yeah, that's your own fault. You got to attack that. <laughs> right? You eat the forward throw, bro. It's way less damage. Oh, God. It's yeah, an online real. play. Yeah. That's, uh... Ah, you can't do that. You gotta do 5k if you're gonna punish a crouch move. When he disrespects on the whiff, goes right in for the base hold K. And he banked it all on that risk. Good move, man. The Spectre Cloud has the Oki situation here. Going for the stance pressure, kicks him out of the air, and he has him right up against the wall right where he wants him. But Duke's gonna switch to positioning with the back throw. Alright, no fear. And this lack of fear is getting you custom combos. Oh! Did he get it? Did he get it? He did. Okay. Ops for the uh, A slide B into there. Okay, he saw this wall pressure. He's looking very strong. Uh, oh, yeah. No, he wasn't. Yeah, that was. Uh, that soul charge guy yeah, rattled every, like, Jenga piece he had. And then he resorted back to, like, eight ABs, which historically did not work in the set. 
and of course he stepped it as he did the other times and that cost him mm -hmm. yeah then dupe with a crazy call it off the 1k